Based on the CDC's new recommendations, Mercer University says it's changing its guidelines. Students received an email from the school saying masks are no longer mandatory, effective immediately. Taylor Hicks is live at Mercer University with the details. Boy, Mercer students and staff members can finally say goodbye to these. Now, this is a mask if you can't tell, but you have to be fully vaccinated. Now, I spoke with some students that say they've been waiting on this moment for a very long time, and some people that say they think Mercer moved a little bit too fast. So I was very happy to see Mercer lift the mask mandate. Adam Penlin is one of many Mercer students that received an email from the university Monday afternoon saying that masks are no longer required for vaccinated students and staff members. This decision follows recent changes in the CDC guidelines, lifting mask requirements for fully vaccinated people in most settings. I feel good about it. I feel like this is a first step for us to go back to somewhat and what normal life was like before COVID. Penlin says the mask update might even inspire others to get vaccinated. I think this would be a great way for more students to go, okay, I want to go ahead and get vaccinated if they haven't already, uh, so they don't have to worry about that when they come to campus in the fall. But sophomore Harsh Singh says he thinks the university made this decision quickly. Uh, it's going to be a lot of wait and see, and I sincerely hope it works. I know a lot of us are fatigued by all this mask wearing, so... Um, I kind of like the direction they're heading. I just hope they kind of stay proactive and uh, make active changes if needed. Despite the timing of the decision, Singh says summer will be a good trial period for what is to come in the fall. The CDC's recommendation is based on science, and so we rely on science, and it's a very logical decision, and I think it's a, a it's good timing for that decision now. Kelly Reffitt, Mercer's vice provost, says she's confident in their decision to lift the mask requirement and that she's already seen many students and staff members get vaccinated on their campus. So as more people are vaccinated, they're ready to return to normal. So this is just another step to returning to normalcy, and it feels really good to people. Refit says that health science students and staff members working in clinical settings are still required to wear masks even if they're vaccinated. Reporting live in Macon, Taylor Hicks, 13 WMAZ News. Thank you, Taylor. The university says they will verify who's received their vaccinations and who hasn't through school health records.